Hi guys, today is the 9th of March and it's two years today since the final episode of What Are The Road Aired because you guys know how much What Are The Road means to me it still hurts so much that it's gone that I couldn't let it pass I had to do something for it being two years so today I'm going to talk to you about my current top 10 Waterloo Road teachers. So at number 10 we have Christy Mogra, who we met at the start of Series 8 when we moved to Greenock and she was there right to the end and she had a short spell of getting to be in charge of the school. Number nine is another head teacher, Michael Byrne. So, Michael, does it? I feel like it was series seven he started, but it could have been earlier. I'm going with seven. And he was there until some point during series eight. And at number eight is Daniel Chalk, Chalky. So, oh, when did Chalky start? I'm not sure. It was there for quite a while. I'm not sure when it was. I want to say series six. Oh, series six or seven, I think. I don't know off the top of my head. Um, Chalky taught maths and he took in Kevin, who was then Kevin Skelton, as his own son. So Chalky was there until... was it series 9? Either series 8 or 9. Uh, possibly series 8. I don't know. But he popped up again from time to time because of Kevin. Because Kevin was constantly landing himself in the hospital and things. Well, not quite constantly, but felt like it. <laughs> At number seven, it's Kim Campbell. So, Kim was there right at the start, right from start of series one. She left. I want to say series two. Could be wrong. And then she came. It may have even been just series one that she left. And then she came back for a while. And she was head of pastoral care. And her thing. She was. She was a very good head of pastoral care. Uh, number six is Rachel Mason, another head teacher. She was there, I honestly haven't a clue when she started. <laughs> uh, I want to say series four, but I feel like I'm wrong. Uh, Rachel was a very good head. From what I've seen online, Rachel Mason is one of the fan favourites for head teacher. Um, Number five is Christopher Mead, Chris Mead. So Chris was a science teacher and he, he stands out to me because of how he dealt with skin. Of course, that storyline wasn't so good because it, it, led, it led to him leaving, which is sad. He was brilliant. Uh, number four is Maggie Budgeon. So Maggie... What's Maggie not done? <laughs> Maggie ran the schoolhouse. She taught home ec. She was a dinner lady. She did the lot. 
Um, and she was married. She was married to Grammy. She was originally Maggie Croft. Hmm. She met Grammy at Waterloo Road. And number three is Matt Wilding. So Matt was a music teacher, and and he was a fantastic one. He very briefly took in Sambuca Kelly. I've no idea. I gave up on seeing when they started and left. Okay. Um, I don't actually know when Chris came either. So <laughs> Maggie was. I've no idea. I'm right to the end. <laughs> and Matt Wilder. Matt Wilding was. Yeah. I forgot when a lot of them started, but he was there. He left after the choir competition, came back, and then he left at the end of series seven to be with his daughter instead of going to Greenock. Number two is Grantley Budgeon, the longest lasting character in the whole program. Grantley Budgeon was um, was an English teacher who was in Waterloo Road from right the start of series one until series nine. Right, when he passed away in the school. I won't tell you how, in case you've not watched it. Uh, I'm terrible for spoilers. Uh, yeah, Grantley got through two wives while he was in the school. Started off with Fleur, and then he had Maggie. So he, when they moved to Greenock, he was also running the school bus. And Anyway, number one, Dave and AC. I mean, I feel like I've mentioned a million times who my favourite Waterloo Road character is. So, my f so at number one, it's Tom Clarkson. And I genuinely, I could make like a half hour long video just on the amazing, on how amazing Tom is. I won't. <laughs> uh, Tom. Oh, I guess Tom. Tom was there right from the beginning of series one, right from the start of it, to series eight, episode 30. And again, he died at the school, but I won't tell you how. Because that one's heartbreaking. <laughs> and. He he pretty much took in every kid at Waterloo Road. It was incredible. Honestly, Tom was amazing. But I won't start going on about Tom because I won't be able to stop. So I'm gonna go, guys. But before I go, I just want I just want to say. Remember what I little. Bye guys.